1968, Wilmington University introduced a revolutionary concept to afford the opportunity for traditional and non-traditional students to obtain their college degrees. Under the direction of its founder and first president, Donald E. Ross, the college opened to 147 students. By 1972, enrollment had reached 630 students, and many had work experience. The college catered to working professionals, offering convenient schedules and excellent student service. Sports entered the picture in 1972, when the college established its men's baseball and basketball teams and introduced the world to the Wilmington College Wildcats. Dr. Audrey Cole Doberstein was named president of Wilmington College in 1979. She transformed the college into a thriving institution with satellite campuses throughout Delaware. Student enrollment increased to 10,000. Her successor, Dr. Jack Barcelona, led an exciting era that saw more student services and an active educational community that supported excellence both inside and outside the classroom. Enrollment grew from 10,000 to more than 21,000. Locations increased from 4 to 11, expanding to New Jersey. The college offered nearly 120 online programs by then, making it a regional pioneer in distance learning. The college's sports program became NCAA Division II in 2004, and 11 sports programs were open for male and female students. In 2007, Wilmington College became Wilmington University to better reflect its strong strategic plan and evolve in nature. The college had already met the criteria to be considered a university, including multiple campuses and programs of study ranging from associate to doctoral programs, and it served 11,000 students. Divisions became colleges, education, business, technology, health professions, social and behavioral sciences, arts and sciences, and later, the College of Online and Experiential Learning. And we were ranked second fastest growing nonprofit doctoral institution in America from 2004 to 2014 by the Almanac of the Chronicle of Higher Education. Ground was broken in 2011 for the 22,000 square foot Wilmington University Sports Complex, which provided a home to the men and women athletes who by then comprised 11 teams plus an award-winning cheerleading squad. Today, WilmU sponsors 16 intercollegiate teams. Having an international reach, students from India, Nepal, China, Turkey, and Bangladesh have joined the Wilmington University family, and I'm here in Rome, Italy, working on my doctoral degree. And construction began for Wilmington University Brandywine, a state-of-the-art facility that now serves students from the Brandywine 100 and surrounding Pennsylvania communities. It also houses the university's new Criminal Justice Institute. On July 1, 2017, Dr. Laverne T. Harmon was unanimously approved by the Board of Trustees to become Wilmington University's fourth president. Committed to Wilmington University's strategic initiatives, Dr. Harmon is as dedicated to students as she was in 1989, when she first joined the university. Today, Dr. Harmon leads a thriving university that serves nearly 20,000 students who can choose from some 150 degree and certificate programs and 130 fully online programs. Wilmu is committed to building and nurturing academic and corporate partnerships and celebrating a growing list of partner schools in Delaware and New Jersey. As we commemorate five decades of academic excellence and student service, we continue to offer opportunity, flexibility, and convenience to diverse students. We are committed to our institutional values, to respect each other, allow integrity to guide our choices, honor educational opportunity as our primary purpose, and to be responsive to community needs. Our mission, to offer opportunities to all who wish to transform their lives through quality education has never been stronger.